This video is sponsored by Squarespace. Almost exactly three years ago, I had a solid career in mechanical engineering. I had worked super hard to get my master's degree and have a good job in the field, but all it took was three words from Maddie Hapoya to ruin everything. But the question is, how did I get here? The key to closing that gap from beginner to professional is really simple. It's this, learn, make, repeat. At that point, something ignited in me. I didn't quit my job, I didn't go buy the best camera on the market. I just made a decision to start learning everything I possibly could about video. Okay, here we go. Hi, I'm Jake Fru. I'm technically a mechanical engineer, but I've always kind of felt like a fraud saying that. I can remember at that time, I'd, I don't think I watched anything on TV. All I was doing was watching filmmaking tutorials on YouTube and going out to film whatever I could after work. I filmed a bunch of plants and squirrels and my feet walking around the neighborhood. Anything I could film, I was filming after work and then listening to tutorials while I was at work. Now, obviously, when I say Maddie ruined my career, that's all tongue in cheek because deep down, there's always something in me that really wanted to do something with video, but I just, I didn't believe it was possible. I felt like I had put so much time and work into mechanical engineering that the gap was just too big and too unrealistic to be able to make that switch. I didn't think that I could ever make a living with video and I absolutely did not think it would ever be possible for me to have a sponsored YouTube video. And so I said it last time and I'll say it again today, it really is surreal and a dream come true to have this video sponsored by Squarespace. If you need a website and are overwhelmed at the prospect of it, squarespace.com is the place for you to start. Their templates are super clean and easy to use, so it's super easy to import content from other sites, from social media platforms. It's a completely all-in-one tool, so you can buy your domain name there, you can set up an e-commerce platform there, you can really do whatever you need. So if you go to squarespace.com slash jakefrew, you get a completely free trial, you can test out the tools, start building your site, and then if you use the code jakefrew at checkout, you get 10% off your first purchase of a website or a domain. Now, in Maddie's video, he showed one of his oldest videos and then one of his newer videos, and the contrast between those two blew my mind so much, seeing how much he had improved, that it really became the catalyst for why I started this YouTube channel and started practicing video. I learned so much by posting one video per week. And so just by following that process of learn, make, repeat, that's what eventually ended my career in mechanical engineering. Hope you don't mind me filming everything. I'm starting to vlog. Are you? You guys are signed up for it. Yeah. <laughs> it's a big day because for now at least, I'm done being a mechanical engineer. I don't think I told you I'm starting to vlog. So I'm carrying my camera everywhere. Heck yeah, dude. It's um, June 21st, 2019. Just last week, I quit my job. For the first time in my life, I am self-employed. I'm pretty stoked about it. It's officially the last week of summer. I'm in Seattle, Washington right now, and I'm so stoked because I'm finally done with my first ever short film. I wanted to make this video for two reasons. First, just as a thank you to Maddie. If you happen to be seeing this, thank you for posting that video because it literally changed my life. Just that simple idea of learn, make, repeat was the catalyst for a completely different trajectory for my life that I'm so thankful has unfolded. The second reason is just that I wanted to recognize the power of an idea. <laughs> Oh, 
It's such a simple concept, but something about hearing that concept explained by someone else really changed something in my brain that allowed me to, I guess, simplify it. It was no longer this massive leap that I had pictured in my head, but it kind of it made it a logical practice in my mind. If an idea that simple had such a profound impact on my life, I want to continue to share those things as much as possible. Now I think the major key to all of this is that you have to fall in love with the process of learning and making. It's so easy to get caught up in the external validation and especially numbers on YouTube or any social media platform. It's really easy to get caught up in that, but you have to fall in love with the process of learning things and making things. Because if you fall in love with the external validation and the numbers, it will break you eventually. Those metrics are going to go up and down and they're going to disappoint you and, and in those low times you really have to remember why you're making things. So I hope this was helpful in some way and I hope this served as a reminder to enjoy the filmmaking process and go get some of those travel feels. <laughs> I don't know how to wink.